Good morning, and today is the 29th of November 2016. The time is currently half past 12 in the p.m. Oh, why? Forget something. Look what I've left up here. Yeah. My friggin' slippers. This is what we're having for dinner tonight. It's thundery chicken in pizza po in pizza pockets. I haven't had anything to eat yet. I, I went to bed this morning at 6 a.m. and then I got up today at half past 11. Had a shower because that's only five hours sleep. Had a shower, just wake myself up a little bit. Now let's get some breakfast. So anyway, the uh, lineup for today looks a little bit like this. We're going to be fixing the washing machine today. So we actually got the the components sorry, that I needed to fix the washing machine. So we're going to be fixing that today. Like that's the first thing we're going to be doing. And then after that, we're going to be going upstairs. Uh, I have been solid editing like a mad person. And I'm happy to say I literally have got only like two vlogs to edit. So not final because I've got like seven to final or something or six to final. But this shouldn't take long. Hopefully it shouldn't take long. It should take an hour to finalize all of those vlogs to add all their bits and for their tracks and all that jazz. I'll have them done today and then it'll just be rendering upload rendering upload rendering upload literally like that that's how it's gonna the pace is gonna be i'm gonna crack on eat my breakfast and then we're gonna go on and do that bloody washing machine so here's the circuit board that we're gonna fix today and this is the part that we're going to change. So that's what we're going to change today. Uh, this component goes here. Can you see how this one completely flat? And this one has become imploded. So that one there. So that bit there has become imploded. Um, and that's basically what's causing this issue. So what you need to do is this. Find the part of circuit that needs to be removed. My one is here. And what you do you just heat the solder underneath while giving a little tug to the to the actual component that you're pulling out once this heats up enough it will come off sorry about that the camera ran out of memory anyway uh, like i was saying before on the circuit there is a side that got like a white color like this and the other side would be dark like that so this white side inside of uh you'll see inside here i don't know if you guys can see that on camera so you see that inside there, I use this to kind of locate one. This bit here, this is white, this ring, and there's the other hole is here. So what you need to do is make sure this white side on the side of your component actually goes into the hole like this. So you actually are aiming to get the white side going through that hole. That's your kind of like positive negative. Once that's pulled in properly, uh, you just literally need to solder that in place. So then you get some soldering iron like this. Uh, you get some flux onto your onto your actual soldering iron. Just need a little bit. Find the place that you want to actually solder. You just touch the two bits together. Mm. 
and that's pretty much it. So as you can see those two parts have now been soldered on. You can see the fresh solder there coming out. Uh, and then all you need to do is obviously trim off these ends uh, with your pliers. And that's basically it. That component's in there now, solid, just like the others are. And that's ready to go back into the washing machine and hopefully it'll work fine. And literally, this was what the problem was. Cost 80p. Let's just keep fingers crossed that it actually works. Okay, so we've got the component. I'm just gonna put this back in the machine. So obviously, you just gotta plug all the wiring. So here's all the wiring. It's pretty hard to mess up on this stuff because it kind of all goes in a specific way so uh, this piece goes up here like this this one goes here let's put this back in its housing so this just slides back in here and this cover goes over the top and then now we can plug everything back just check everything is nicely hooked up and then just feed this back in here Before I bolt everything on, I'm just going to have a quick little test to see how this actually wor is working. So, and that's it. Ready to wash. And it's as easy as that, boys and girls. As easy as that. Okay, uh, I'm upstairs in the studio. I had, obviously, I was just finishing breakfast. I've been up here for a couple of hours. I haven't recorded because the camera ran out of memory. This is so freaking annoying because i love the quality this camera's given me but i absolutely hate the fact that i haven't got the memory card to record my whole day of vlogging but that's about to change uh, the wife has ordered me my brand new memory card it's coming very soon hopefully tomorrow or the day after and then all of these issues will be gone also we'll be recording a brand new set of time lapses for the vlog with this camera i haven't come across a vlog yet where i'm editing with the camera yet hopefully from what i can see so far the footage looks pretty good the audio is okay it could be better i think i might whack the audio microphone up on the camera only downer with this camera in particular the only thing criticism i have of canon of making when they've made this eos uh, m10 is there is no external microphone jack that's the only downer because i would have loved to plug some sort of mic onto this camera to give better audio but you know my budget is tight and there's only so much i can spend and there's so, only so much the wife was willing to spend um on the camera so beggars can't be choosers anyway i've got to go downstairs i've got to get changed to get ready for work we're going to my brother's house i can't be bothered to drag my clothes there to get changed and all that jazz so i'm just going to get changed at home and then we're going to go straight there and then from there i'm going to go straight to work and that will be that um, i'm working till 11 today so when i come home i'm not sure if i'm going to continue vlogging uh it's a bit like this at the moment but either way if we don't i love your faces and i'll see you tomorrow